Welcome to the Fine Music Guide on cleaning or swabbing a clarinet. It is important to swab your instrument after playing to remove any moisture. This will help keep the pads in good condition and stop them from swelling, which can cause a leak in the instrument. When you have finished playing, the first thing you need to do is take the reed off the mouthpiece, wipe it down and put it somewhere where it can dry before putting it in its case. Take off the ligature and then remove the mouthpiece. The clarinet swab, or pull through, is made from either cotton, microfiber or silk. Microfiber and silk work better than cotton as they are more absorbent. The pull through will have a weighted string attached to the body which helps you get the swab through the clarinet. The simplest way to swab your clarinet is to take the weighted end and drop it down the bell of the instrument. Then you can pull it all the way through. Make sure the swab is not folded or scrunched as this may cause it to get stuck. It is also important to know there is a tube that protrudes inwardly in the top part of the upper joint. Passing the swab from the bell to the barrel helps you get past this tube with ease. You may need to repeat this a few times to ensure you have removed all the moisture. If you are having issues with water sitting under the pads and gurgling while you are playing, dropping the swab through the top of the clarinet instead of the bell can help with this because it encourages the water to take a different path to travel through the instrument. When pulling the swab through this way, it's best to tilt the clarinet as you pull the swab through to prevent it from getting stuck. If you have a wooden instrument, make sure you wipe the ends of the tenons after you pull it apart if there is any moisture on them. You can then disassemble your instrument to put back in the case. To clean the mouthpiece, how you do it depends on whether it's made of hard plastic or hard rubber. The mouthpiece that comes with student clarinets is generally made from plastic and more expensive or upgraded mouthpieces are made of hard rubber. For more information on cleaning rubber mouthpieces, Van Doren have a great guide on their website. We're going to talk about cleaning plastic mouthpieces today. You can clean the mouthpiece with a smaller swab, like this one from Yamaha, by pulling it all the way through the mouthpiece. You can also use a disinfectant spray like Sterisol or Steri Spray, or you can rinse the mouthpiece with some warm soapy water, making sure not to get the cork wet. When you are finished, put your swabs aside to dry and wash them every few weeks. Your whole clarinet, the mouthpiece, should be swabbed after every playing session. Thanks for watching.